Finally, it's sweater weather. For the Northern Hemisphere, anyway. As the September equinox ushers in the first day of astronomical fall in the Northern Hemisphere and spring in the Southern Hemisphere, it's a reminder of how ancient cultures used the sky as a clock and calendar. Early civilizations even built observatories to track these annual solar movements. So what actually happens? The reason we have seasons is primarily thanks to the Earth's tilted axis, which causes the northern and southern hemispheres to take turns receiving the sun's direct light and warmth. During an equinox, the sun shines directly over the equator, and there will almost be the same amount of daytime and nighttime for everyone on the planet, except at the poles, where the sun hovers along the horizon throughout the day. We can observe this from space by watching the Earth's Terminator. Cool name. The boundary between nightfall shadows and the sunlight of dawn and dusk. Here are some images stitched together into a movie where you can see the Terminator shift back and forth. You can see the sunlight move from being concentrated in the south to the north, wherever you are on Earth. Happy Equinox.